Cybernetically Enhanced Mammalian Item Number SCP-1991 Object Class Safe Special Containment Procedures SCP-1991 is to be stored in a 5x5x5 five by five by five meter containment chamber within Site-19's biological specimen's wing. Due to the specimen's behavior, a locked door is considered to be all that is required to prevent escape. SCP-1991 is to be fed 3 kilograms of cooked and pulped beef daily. Water is to be provided via a trough, which is to be kept refilled constantly. Containment cell is to be cleaned weekly by Class D personnel. Description SCP-1991 is a 2 meter long quadruped mammalian creature of unknown species, enhanced by the implantation of cybernetic compounds. Both implanted compounds and creature show signs of damage consistent with extreme age, poorly healed puncture wounds, bullets of assorted calibers embedded beneath the skin, burns comparable to those produced by industrial cutting lasers, and starvation. SCP-1991 appears to have suffered psychological damage as a result of physical abuse or trauma, displaying extreme fear of loud noises, rapid movements, and aggression or seeming aggression by personnel. SCP-1991's body core is roughly humanoid, with elongated limbs of equal length. All limbs end in hands, similar to those of a large primate, apart from the presence of elongated claws. The head resembles a mummified canine skull with elongated incisor teeth. Skin resembles decayed leather with matted fur growing from it, primarily around the ankles and back of the neck. SCP-1991 lacks a tail. When recovered, SCP-1991 displayed traits of starvation, including enlarged gut and emaciated limbs. Proper feeding while in containment has been shown to cure said traits. Cybernetics consist of a mechanical collar, implantation of unidentified structure into right forelimb, sharpened steel blades replacing teeth and claws of forelimbs, as well as data expunged, system alterations of unknown usage. Collar consists of a metal disc embedded in the front of the neck, possessing a small speaker array, non-functional due to bullet damage, six video cameras, two of which have broken lenses, and a complex network of data expunged. Fibers, apparently serving as linkage slash control to its central nervous system, non-functional due to blank. Due to the non-functional nature of linkage between its nervous system and the camera network on the shield, SCP-1991 appears to be blind. The right forelimb structure consists of a pair of miniature mechanical clamps and an extending rotary metal rod similar to the triggering equipment of remotely operated firearms. It is assumed that the clamps were intended to serve as the mounting system for such a weapon. SCP-1991 Test Logs Behavioral Test Log 1991-1 Tests of SCP-1991 Behavior in Regards to Positive Stimuli Supervisor, Dr. Blank Stimulus, Dr. Blank saying, Hello, in a normal and calm voice Effect upon Subject SCP-1991 having huddled in the furthest corner of the containment chamber upon Dr. Blank's entry, emerged and hesitantly licked Dr. Blank's outstretched hand Supervisor, Dr. Blank Stimulus SCP-1991 petted on the top of the head by Dr. Blank. Effect upon subject. SCP-1991 emitted gurgling noise assumed to be a sign of pleasure. Supervisor, Dr. Blank. Stimulus. SCP-1991 given common canine chew toy shaped like a teddy bear. Effect upon subject. SCP-1991 prodded toy with forepaw, causing it to squeak. SCP-1991 proceeded to emit whimpering noise and huddle against the furthest wall of the containment chamber until Chew Toy was removed. End Log Behavioral Test Log 1991-2 Tests of SCP-1991 Behavior in Regards to Negative Stimuli Supervisor, Agent Blank Stimulus, Agent Blank saying, Hello, in a raised and aggressive voice. Effect upon Subject SCP-1991 proceeded to rapidly move to the furthest edge of the chamber from Agent Blank and attempted to curl into a ball. Supervisor, Agent Blank. Stimulus, Agent Blank clapping hands in front of SCP-1991. Effect upon subject, SCP-1991 whimpered and attempted to cover head with forepaws. Supervisor, Agent Blank. Stimulus, gunshot from starter pistol into the air outside containment chamber. Effect upon subject, SCP-1991 urinated on floor of containment chamber and huddled twitching on the opposite side of chamber from the door until ending of the test. End log. History. 
SCP-1991 was recovered by Foundation agents in blank, 19 blank, following reports of a monster scavenging from dumpsters in data expunged, a small town in blank. Cover story regarding vagrants planted, 